go. I kind of wish I owned Project M, and I kind of I wish I don't. I mean, you guys can go I like it, but then sometimes I just absolutely hate it. Yeah, there's some things to hate, uh, especially if you were born in Melee or I mean, a previous game. I just wish it would stay the same. Like, it's a good game. I, I believe before 3.5, it was a good enough game. No, the 3.5 fixes were logical. They made sense, especially if you've ever made it down to Florida and tried playing against Lucas's, which seems to be rampant in Florida. You, you'd agree that Lucas did need his nerfs, and you'd agree that four Dins Fires is too many Dins Fires for Zelda. And there's a lot of changes that made a lot of sense. Some people lost their mains because, like, Samus's tether being gone. Uh, on, what is on, gone now? It's not gone for the level. It's gone for the grab. She can't tether grab anymore. She has to go up to you and grab you by hand now. So a lot of, you'll see a lot of uh, Zero Suits play their style differently. Uh, Fu from Concord is one that I saw who really struggled to uh, make the jump right away. Tried to Zero Suit uh, still have a tether? She has her tether for level. She can get back to level with tether. But she lost her tether grab, so she doesn't match her Samus counterpart. Is your side B a kill move now? Or did they nerf that? They nerfed a few things. I couldn't be, I'm not an expert for Zero Suit Samus, but I know they nerfed a lot of things. I think side B was one of them. I know. I'm waiting you for then. Michael Tan to get back. And then I'll add one more. My next game is for a long time. Alright. Yeah. 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 We're getting the initial bands out of the way, and it looks like we're going to Smashville. I think there should just be a rule. Let's go to Smashville first game, no matter what. Go ahead, man. No, it's fine. Okay. Our technical man is pinned in the corner, so we gotta try to come in. They're going to Smashville, and we got game one here. Class stage. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Foo versus I got Cap. I'm just call him Cap. I like it. <laughs> this is uh. Is this supposed to be like Kappa? The oh, it's uh Cap Foo or something. Like that, so. X Y L B. All right, you wait for this uh this match. Yeah. Right on, man. All right, so Foo going in right now uh, a little bit. I like Mars matchup here though. He, he's got a really easy matchup. Yeah, I, I feel think. like Mars has the definite advantage in this game. Yeah, his he, he just keeps that range going. I think Mars is like the 20xx killer. As long as Marth is playing really spacing, like his spacing game correctly, he can just run over most people. Yeah. Uh, no matter how powerful their moves are effective. And Cap's putting his uh, spacing to work right now. Not letting Ganon get in for any big hits, just minor hits that Ganon's been able to get how up to like, How do you like Ganon in this version? I like Ganon in this version. I like his mind games from his float. I like how quick you can, his uh, his L cancel adjustments are, so he can just do aerial, L cancel, aerial, L cancel, over, over. I don't understand his downtown. What is it? His down, ooh. Is it like an actual beautiful. move? That was, that was really nice. His downtown taunt is pretty much the, the replacement for Wizard Punch, because he has sort of a uh, an object reflex, reflecting cape on neutral B now. So yeah. he holds down taunt, takes out his sword. If you keep holding it, uh, you end up doing the equivalent uh, of Falcon Punch with a sword. So, um, good times. It looks a lot like um, Mars neutral B. It does, but it hits like a... Eww, oh, oh, wow! Both are still living. Oh, oh, oh both are right still living. That was almost <laughs> amazing. Foo's... Foo's uh, <laughs> Fu wasn't able to return uh, his second jump in time, so he, he got caught in the abyss. And, oh, oh Fu, Fu's losing a little composure right here. He, he definitely was in the game a few seconds ago, but this game could flip. It's one of the few yeah. fighting games in the world where you can you can end yourself. So That's what's so unique, and that's what I love about this game. Yeah. Fu's fighting back, though. Uh, he's, still, he's still very much in this. Uh, but he's, nice spacing with the lucky his, his DI yeah. is all in right there. That that really was the story of it. He made that Mars combo uh, just by DI oh, and try to go for the hard read. Gets it this time. Doesn't. Oh, he does convert. Nice. That float is mind games. Messed with me. I didn't even see it coming. <laughs> oh. I think nice. he's living. Living. Oh. I've never seen that before. <laughs> Fantastic. That's uh, looks like Smash Four stuff. Yeah. <laughs> so. Ganon is so disrespectful in Smash 4. If, uh, if we watch his DI here, he, he could probably convert to stock, because it's getting to the point where uh, Marth can't combo very easily if his DI is on point. Yeah. Marth loses his combo ability between 740, uh, or 140 and 80 on most characters, so... That's that, was, that was a grab ledge scenario. Yeah. Fu, Fu had every opportunity to grab ledge. It. If he grabs a ledge... That's it. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Well done. Jeremy. Nice I'll run back. Yeah, nice run back. Okay. <laughs> he made he made his technical mistakes and he just he calmed down. He didn't leave the level. That was really it. He didn't leave the level again. He just said I'll, I'll be on this level. <laughs> I wish that Ganon and Spike had come through and he made it back because that would have been awesome. Uh, distant planets gone, guys, automatically, uh, and the whole top row, and then uh, just get rid of the top row and you're good. 
and then I think it's three count. Or is it kind of it's not legal in singles? It's doubles only, yeah. Uh, and then it's three three band. Oh. I really wish PM was at Apex. Yeah, I I was listening to some podcasts about Apex. Uh, it sounds like it's going to be an amazing tournament, but you can't be too mad. You can't be too mad. I don't think games are defined by one tournament. And as much as I want to go to Apex and play Project M, there's five games for Smash at Apex would be a little yeah. redundant. But still, uh, Project M such a it's such a fun game to watch. Yeah, it is, it is an absolutely fun game to watch. Uh, I heard that uh, Evo picked up Melee and uh, Smash, Wii, 4. Wii, Smash 4, which I'm pumped about. Yeah, uh, it gives awesome. me an excuse to go to Vegas, you know. So. <laughs> Are you going to go? Oh, yeah. yeah. I, I, I wish I could have gone to Apex, but I made it to Paragon. I usually make it around the country. Paragon, Paragon was in uh, Orlando. No, I know I know what Paragon was. Yeah. yeah that was pretty funny when Me Too King got whooped. By the <laughs> I was more impressed with... Uh, well, let, let's get back on the game. Yeah. There's a lot of fun stuff to talk about, but these two actually did a character switch, so this is a totally different game. Mm-hmm. Oh, he almost uh, got that. Looks point. like we're playing melee in here, actually, right yeah. now. Is there anything different about Sheik and PM 3.5? You know, I don't feel like. Oh, ooh, that that was yeah, that was just a, a little misstep. He's just trying to get Randall. There really isn't. She she feels like melee. She really does. Yeah, and that's what I think they were trying to achieve with both of these characters: get them close to their melee forms. I mean, that was the original point of Project M was to get Falco. Randall's being a jerk right now. Both Randall's. both players have died going for Randall and missing. <laughs> I've had some bad experiences. Forever. Yeah, can't find who really has the advantage right now, but Falco's stacking it up. Yeah, I thought it was gonna shine him off the top back there. <sighs> Sheik having trouble getting in. Those tilts, though, you can just throw them out as Sheik, and, and people will run into them. Yeah. Uh, your approach has to be really clean if you're playing against Sheik with a character like Falco who does not have disjointed hitboxes. That's it. That'd be oh, Ooh, that was that was overconfidence. He was trying. He was trying to nice stop. laser. Run. Yeah, he cleaned up. He cleaned up. Grab. That was a really uh, clean shield grab. But I think uh, Falco missed the uh, L cancel because he could have L canceled Shine to get out of there. Shine? Shine, oh. Shine almost kills. Nice reactions, though. Yeah, these players are going in. This is actually a really good first round. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot of times you'll see, especially with seeding, first round be very boring, but these players are really seem to be on par oh, with each nice. other. Nice. Up throw to down air. Up throw to down air. Uh, I, don't, I don't know if Cap could have uh, DI oh. back correctly. <laughs> Zelda. We have a Zelda Switch. This is, is the right game for it. If you see that in Melee, you should be concerned. But here, <laughs> here is the right game to be doing that. I met, I met, I met some Zelda mains in Melee recently. I didn't know it was a thing. <laughs> I saw one at uh, Fight Pit. It was mm -hmm. kind of fun. This is actually not. I don't disagree with this choice if his Zelda's on point because yeah. like he's so disjointed now. He's got his equivalent Shine. He's got tons of like sustained hitboxes. He can really stop Falco from doing a lot of things. I can never really understand what. Result is if it's a tilt or, up, or, or like a smash, because they all look similar in my opinion. Yeah, uh, I think all the smashes have really heavy sustained hitboxes, and that's probably the only real reason you'd see a difference. Uh, a lot was, of the other ones are pecs. Was that a back throw that killed? I think that was actually, yeah. I don't know, that killed this kid. Oh, yep. Yeah. Oh, on this level, especially oh, at, yeah, at yeah. 130. Oh, nice oh, forward smash. Nice game. Good read. Yeah. Is that the game? And, uh, yeah. Yeah. Are you guys commentating right now? Cap, yeah. She just sit there.